Let's take a look at how to add social network buttons from addthis.com. This is their home page. You create an account. I happen to be logged in already. There are buttons of various sizes. I like the big ones. Press Get the Code. This is the code that needs to go onto your website. And here is what the buttons look like. This is the first button, which is the Facebook button. And this is the second button for Twitter. And then there's the email button and a printer button. And add this additional networking buttons and some counter bubble. Let's grab the code. Clicking this button will copy the code. Once logged into our control panel, we go to Site Info. Toward the bottom of the page, there is a field for your social buttons. If you have the mobile package, there is an additional field for the mobile site as well. Paste the code into the box. I don't want the printer button and uh, not the counter bubble either, so I will remove those. Uh, so let's remove the fourth button and the bubble. I will copy the code into the mobile version as well and remove this class called add this 32 by 32 style to make it smaller. Then press save and now we have the social network buttons. However, it does not fit on the same line, so an additional tweak is necessary. For the regular website, we need to add style equals quotation mark width colon 150 px end quotation mark. And for the mobile site, using the smaller buttons, we need to specify the width as style equals quotation mark width colon 85 pixels end quotation marks and then save and see how it looks the width will vary depending on how many buttons you choose to include we included four buttons but you might want to include more or less you may have to test a few times, but don't forget, there may be a one minute delay before your changes takes effect due to cached or saved data.